good day everybody it's jerry from bsk garage in today's video we're going to talk about how to determine the thread and pitch size for example i got this axle breather right here and i'm going to need to drill and tap a hole to insert that axle breather how do i determine what the size is there's a few methods i'm going to go over to help you guys determine if you don't know how to do it there's one that's going to be the easy way of course if you have a tap and die set you can just keep going along and finding one that matches up but of course if you have a tap and die set you're also going to have if it's a good set a thread pitch gauge with you which you're going to line up to help you determine so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to measure the size of those threads so i got my dial caliper here so i'm going to measure it and i'm at about 0.425 to six roughly so at this point you're going to google and you're going to realize that 0.425 to a fraction is closest to 7 16th so now i come to my chart that came with my tap and die set we know 7 16th we have a 14 thread count in a 20 fine thread count. So I got my thread pitch. So I'm going to find the one that says 14 first. So you can see it says 14. Come over here. No go. So now we know that we are fine thread. Now you can see, it says 20 pitch. Come back over here. And the teeth line up perfect. So we know it's 7 16 fine thread, 20 pitch. So of course, you come back over here. We know we need a 25, 64 drill bit for the tap. So I got a scrap piece of metal, 25, 64 three drill bits to drill there it's just drill it tap it out and check hole is drilled let's grab our 7 16 number 20 verify that's what it is all right let's tap this So now this is the interesting part. That's the size we're supposed to be. I don't like that fit, it's too loose. So good thing I didn't drill my axle. So I'm gonna re-drill it. Next size smaller, 3 8 and re-tap it. Let's try this again. This is going to be a tighter hole and I feel way better right now. I feel way better. I'm actually cutting. So now with the three eighths hole, it's quite a bit tighter. So we're going to roll with that. Main reason being that this is not a perfect science. This, this could be off. Like we measured it and the diameter is thinner. So that's the reason why it's going to be looser. So that's why I went with the smaller bolt hole. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one.